So this year we're in a, we're in a different place. We're in Canary Wharf. We've got uh, the, you know the tall buildings and but the water around as well. But what's very interesting is we're actually in the decanter offices. We feel that we're part of the publishing process, but in the end, it's the wines and the notes that we give that's the most important thing. It is the benchmark. It's the biggest. We take enormous care over absolutely every single stage of the process. We go to great trouble to get qualified judges working on their specialised areas. So the level of expertise that's going in is, is I think, unrivalled. It runs with a discussional aspect and wine for me is a conversational thing. It's something that it's important to share opinions and decanter managers to capture that the best, I think. I think that the DWWA has provided a sense of normality in a very unpredictable and strange year. And to show the wine world that actually you can hold a wine competition and large scale wine tastings in the current climate. If you can do this, you can do anything. <laughs> no other year will be as important as this one to maintain that customer engagement. And the more we shout and scream about fantastic wines, the better. It's even more important now that producers actually can say if they were successful. It's just going to help them give that little bit extra boost to help sales. Essentially, we're still doing the same thing. We're still getting together at a socially distanced level, but really, it's about applying your expertise to these wines. This year is challenging, it's different, but it's also really exciting. <laughs>